Once upon a time, there was a musician, and this musician was having a show. And the crowd was fucking pumping, like the show was great. And then there was people in the crowd, and they were crowd surfing. And the musician was like, what the fuck? You can't do that. My fans can't be fucking lifting each other up. That's not cool. Fuck that shit. So that musician made it a kind of like a rule, like un unspoken rule, that no one was allowed to crowd surf at his shows but him. He was the only fucking like person that could crowd surf, which put him in actual physical touch with all these fans, right? But what this musician didn't know and didn't even conceive of is that he was being drained of his talent with all these people touching him and with, um, shit, I just got distracted. It was really good. I was doing so good with my storytelling too. Um, <clears throat> But he also, he, he was losing energy by letting all these people, his fans, even though they loved him, they were touching him and they had, they all have their own like ick. So they were like putting their ick onto him. And because they look up to him and because he's so powerful, they want some of that. So when he a crowd serves, it isn't just like the fans like coming together and like, building a, like, a community where, like, anybody could be lifted up. This musician put him in the position to be sucked dry and seen as, like, this extra whatever. So, anyways, there's a parable for you. <laughs>